Côte d'Ivoire, or Ivory Coast, is where today's proverb comes from. The death of an elderly person is like a burning library. When I moved to Tobago, I was very excited. I was looking forward to talking to the seniors. As far as I was concerned, they are a well of untapped information. I was interested in stories that could tie Trinidad and Tobago to specific places in Africa. COVID had just hit, so I was waiting for things to die down before I would approach one. Every day on my walk, I would pass seniors sitting on the verandas of their houses. Afternoon, Papa, I would say, as I waved to them and they waved to me. Unfortunately, things got worse with COVID, and I knew that it was time to come home to Eden. That opportunity was lost. While I was selling my furniture, I had a conversation with one of my purchasers. I shared with her that the funny language that Trini speak is not made up. It's actually steeped in Kikongo. She then shared, Well, the old people used to call Trinidad Little Congo. Ooh, I got excited. Do you know any of those people I could speak with? I asked her. She laughed and said, They all must be rolling in the grave now. Another library burned, just like that. But her information led me to find songs in Creole about the Congo by Trinis. I am in the land of my ancestors now. The flip side is that the young people that I have spoken with have listened to me as if I am a senior with a library of information. I intend on being a person who gives information to the next generation. But bet your bottom dollar, I am squeezing knowledge out of all the elderly people that I meet. The death of an elderly man or woman is like a burning library.